Then there is the fundamental one, which is people, pub, people's initiative, popular initiative, sorry, at Article 257. And this is what we at Third Way Alliance Kenya followed when we wanted to amend the constitution. We formulated what we call general propositions. Then we went to the people and we asked the people, we have too many members of parliament. That was our proposal. We want to reduce these members of parliament to a certain number. Do you agree or do you not agree? The people said, we want this, we want this. We want to increase more money to the counties. We want 35%. We moved from the current language of at least 15% to at least 35%. We wanted the people to have a say because it was going to affect, you know, their, their, I mean, uh, the, the constitution. But look at BBI. BBI said on the reverse. It started with the two individuals sitting on a, on, a, on, a, on a room, the two of them, and said, we have got what is called shared prosperity. You can imagine if the president of Kenya was to be held ransom by all the 47 million Kenyans said, you and I have shared prosperity. Let's have a handshake. That handshake begets BBI. So how many BBIs will we have in this country? So they did that. Then they forced the country. And remember, when I followed the constitution under Article 257, I never got any state resources to collect signatures, to draft the bill, to go around this country. But two individuals sit, one of them not even elected. One is elected, yes, as president, but one is a stranger in government, in, 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 in elected po in politics. In practice of politics, in, as it were. In practice of politics, as it were. But they managed to invoke the public coffers, spend your taxes betok and run their own personal individual project. Now they call BBI. Then later on, they come to sanitize it by a record due of one week, collected 4.5 million signatures. Now the county assemblies are being forced to pass it through bribery means. It is going to cost you to Kenyan taxpayer 4.5 billion Kenya shillings for this bill to be passed, even though you disagree with it.